me tonight in the office and thanks. I think Rogers covered just about everybody except maybe two or three people. He didn't pat himself on the back. It was a logistic nightmare. He did a great job. But the other people that he didn't thank were the five board selectmen. The town would not have had that choice to go forward financially without the actions of this board. And I want to publicly thank this board for bringing us an agreement and bringing us an opportunity. I think Roger covered just about everybody else, except for the, uh, I'm on the pro side. I guess everybody knows that. I would like to thank the casinofacts.org side for a dialogue that I think made the final agreement a better document and made the town more aware of what was going on. So I'd like to offer my thanks to them too. Uh, Madam Chair, while he's on that subject, I'd just like to add to that because, you know, for a while there we had been saying that they were the antis, because they, and the pros, I mean, you know, I mean, I never really publicly took a position in, uh, until the uh, second document proved that it was worthwhile to the town. But, um, I mean, they were. They were professional. I'm talking about the uh, anti, so to speak. But uh, they were professional, respectful, courteous, and they are townspeople. And uh, they did a wonderful job of just, uh, you know, expressing their viewpoint, which is a legitimate viewpoint. And I certainly appreciated uh, hearing from them. I uh, love their videos. Uh, I mean, the dog head and all that, if you haven't seen that. But, and they're a wonderful group. I mean, we nobody won or lost. Uh, we're just going into a new era in the town. Uh, we're moving forward with this economic development project. And uh, 